Enter. This is Adam Morse. The British actor and filmmaker lost most of his eyesight in 2009 at age 19 when he was diagnosed with a rare mitochondrial disease. Since then, he starred in television shows, directed a feature film and a Super Bowl commercial. Morse used to keep his blindness a secret. I didn't feel comfortable sharing my condition um, before because every time I did, it would always result in a negative interaction or at least a negative outcome. It wasn't until his feature film Lucid when he was pushed to share his story. Billy Zane was one of the people actually, to be honest, on, on Lucid who laid it on really thick and he said, you've got to tell people. I said, absolutely not, no way. I said, if you knew what I'd been through to get to this point, you know, the only reason I'm here is because, I, you know, people, they, they, don't, they don't know that I'm blind. I would never have got this opportunity, you know, if, if, if they had known. And um, he said, well, what about the people after you? Morse says his on-set work is similar to other directors with a few differences, like working with a large monitor to make the most of the partial peripheral sight he has. He says he may miss some details on shoot day, but that all of the decisions about what will be on screen are made beforehand. I'm not just a blind film director. This behind-the-scenes video of Morse directing a Super Bowl ad for a Google phone feature shows him in action. The impact that that behind-the-scenes video had on people is even greater. He hopes his work opens the door for the next generation of artists living with disabilities. It gives them permission to say, hey, well, don't question whether it's possible or not, because look at this guy, you know? I never had that. Morse's upcoming projects include a documentary about him and a movie about mental health and music. It'll be different, I'm sure, on my next movie, where now that I'm finally, you know, <laughs> open about how I work, you know, I can invite cameras to follow that process really closely in making my next feature film.